You want to play with the Oriwa Ochin Shinigadesu and Nandio? Please don't. <laughs> yeah, you Can I play. please? Please don't. I would recommend doing glitch. <laughs> it, it helps during the clash trials. Uh, that would <laughs> definitely mean. Are you sure? Actually, yeah, we can do hard logic. Action, I don't know how I don't wise know. that is for you. Wow. <laughs> wow. Just a, I know your abilities. This is a this is a story game. This is It's not just story though. It's That's not why just it's story. good. Is it like sudden quick time events? I'll it's, be um, Okay. It, if you say so. It's story and then uh like <laughs> a bunch of quick time events in a row at the end of the chapter, mm -hmm. basically. During the class trial. Yeah. If you're confident, go for it. Okay. We're, we're not bailing you out. <laughs> Wait, you said that after I clicked. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> go up. I'm just like Monokuma. For Smash. Exactly, Monokuma for Smash. I'd vote for him. I'd vote for him for president too, though. Yeah, this I'd vote for Monokuma. This animation bothers me. Why? You're gonna have to get used to it. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> it's very stylized. It's so strange. They have another game coming out in this uh, style. It's not Denkenrampa, but... Huh. It's like some extreme sports game. Or it's like a mega baseball and they play it through the city of Tokyo. Hmm. Interesting. It's supposed to kind of get people hyped for the Olympics, actually. The music in this game is delightful. Yes, I love the... It very much is. <laughs> I love the Denkenrampa music. Scooby-Doo Spooky Island. <laughs> the chanting of the men in skirts. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do know what you're talking about, actually. Yeah, yeah the cult. <laughs> Speaking of skeletons, cult. Rip that boy. That is like my personality and my soul side by side, that bear. <laughs> can be your angle or your... <laughs> angle. You, you know that meme? No. It was a picture of Aaron Hansen, Ego Raptor of Game Grumps. Dancing Hansen. Uh, one where he was dressed in all white and wearing a fedora, a white fedora, I think. And it's like, I can be your angle or your devil. And then it was a picture of him wearing all black <laughs> and like holding a katana or something. I think he was holding a katana, actually. yeah. And it was, it was misspelled, of course. It was supposed to be angel or devil. And it was spelled angle. And then your was spelled Y-U-O-R. And it's oh. just a it's just, just a wonderful meme. Yes, oh dear. it's a classic. Right. Are we supposed to read these? Yeah, you can read. But I have to play. Yeah, so you can read too. Is she gonna be Makoto Naegi? Okay. Do you identify as Makoto Naegi? I don't know who that is. He's the main character. Well, yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, he's who you play as. Mm -hmm. Oh, wonderful. The massive high school towers over all the other buildings in this bustling urban area. It's like the school stands at the center of the entire world. Oh look, there's the school standing at the end of the center of the room. Yeah. Hope's Peak Academy. It brings in top students from every field imaginable, a government-funded school of privilege. They say that if you come here and manage to graduate, you'll be set for life. With hundreds of years of tradition, it sends the cream of the crop into the cream. workforce every year. <laughs> oh yeah. Are you familiar with that clip? I am not sure. Well, man, Randy Savage. Bonesaw is here. <laughs> he, go, he goes on in this rant about the cream of the crop and he starts pulling out coffee creamers. <laughs> the cream of the crop. <laughs> <laughs> I have friends who take coffee creamer shots, the little ones, and I'm like, guys, stop. That's not how you drink. Me and my sister used to drink all of them out of the bowls at restaurants. Yeah. Whenever yeah, we, when we would go. Do. It's gross. <laughs> it's fine. It's gross, though. It was built to raise hope in the nation's future, which makes Hope's Peak a pretty fitting name. Very Japanese. I was gonna say Oriwa Chin Chin Nandio, but I don't wanna overuse it. You're gonna overuse it. Yeah. I think you already have. Epic. There are two things you need to attend this school. One, you have to already be attending high school. Two, you have to be the very best at what you do. You could say. Okay, I would not go to this school. You could say Manko oh, yeah, no. Yeah, in high school. Tom. I'm also not the best at anything I do. <laughs> They're so like that is such a horrible like standard. No ordinary student could enroll here. The only way in is if you're scouted by the school itself. Well, there's other ways to get in besides being academically good. I I was aware. 
<laughs> I wasn't reading. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I may have missed. And standing there at the gate of the ultimate school filled with the ultimate students. Is that the Frisbee team? Oh, it was me. Yeah, would you be the ultimate Frisbee player? Before we go any farther, no. I guess I'm I should introduce myself. Now. My name's Makoto Naegi. Hooray, we don't have to read that part. <laughs> Is that the only part? Are no, you kidding no. me? <laughs> there, are, there are other voice acts. Like the, the are you guys going to let me know so I don't read over something? Uh, no, well, you'll hear it. You oh, have, you've got ears. They work, don't they? Blue is his inner voice. I'm talking into them all the time. I'm sorry, what's that? I can't hear you. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> blue is his mind. Oh. Okay, blue is his mind? Yeah. What does the yellow mean? Is that just highlight? Yeah, it's just important things you should probably oh, know. Oh, no. I should know the name of the school, probably. <laughs> yeah, that would help. <laughs> As you can see, I'm nothing but a hopelessly average high school student. Oh, look, it is me. <laughs> average on the outside, average on the inside. Oh, it's not me. I really don't have much going for me when it comes to grades, special abilities, even personality. I'm sorry, did you say a young adult's fiction protagonist? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I have hobbies and stuff I like to do, but it's not like I'm a psychic or mutant or whatever. Wait, what? Is this... Is this a... Uh, X Men game, and you no, lied to me. <laughs> no. Oh, dang. <laughs> it's kind of. Well, <laughs> a little <laughs> bit. Not really. How, I'm Darn. trying to think. How can we relate this to X Men? I don't know if we can. All right. Like... Well, I mean, it's a school for special students. I think that's it. Some like... of them are almost X Men esque. Uh, well, <laughs> it's right, like probably. Sakura. Yeah. <laughs> like, if you asked me what my favorite song was, or my favorite movie or TV show. They'd all just be whatever's most popular at that particular moment. Wow. Even among the average, I'm completely average, so I can't even say I'm your everyday hero type. That's just who I am. Anyway, I figure it's always good to introduce yourself right off the bat, but you know, if, any, if I have any kind of strong point, so to speak, I'd say I'm a little more gung-ho than other people. I mean, look at me. I'm completely ordinary, but still. Here I am standing in front of the anything but ordinary Hope's Peak Academy. I still can't believe I'm standing here. I wonder if someone like me could survive in a place like this. It's got this overwhelming presence, like it's trying to swallow me whole. Okay. Actually, I went to Lane Tech High School, and it was 4,000 students, and I was homeschooled before that, so my class of one became a class of 1,000. It was insane. I completely understand this line. <laughs> mm -hmm. But it's no wonder I would feel that way. What you have to understand is, well, let me just tell you about the preparation I did last night to get ready for today. Oh no. Nice. Hmm. <laughs> he did epic hacking. Hope's Peak only invites those students who are truly elite in their field. It's such a popular topic, there are threads online dedicated to talking about the school's attendees. So all these students are like famous. Just about. That's stupid. So to prepare, <laughs> I looked up some of those threads. And all I saw was talk about ultimate students who were way beyond your average high schooler. Of course, one incoming student is the <laughs> ultimate pop sensation. Yep. I guess she's a high school girl who's also the lead singer for a pop group famous all over the country. There's also the ultimate baseball star. He was the cleanup hitter for the national high school champs. Pro teams already have their eyes on him. Then there's the ultimate fashionista. The latest dresses in fashion. She's been on the cover of tons of fashion magazines. She's what every high school girl wants to be. Not true. <laughs> no, you didn't want to be like that? No. You could tell. <laughs> just saying, I'm, well, I'm, it's a good thing. I mean, all my clothes almost are from high school. It's great. Oh, and they mentioned the ultimate biker gang leader, too. <laughs> what? <laughs> the scary thing is, he's the de facto leader of every biker gang in Japan. Gangs everywhere love the guy. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's not epic. how gangs work, guys. <laughs> On top it is of in that, this universe, why, okay? why do they? Why do the gangs have their territories, and why do they fight if they're all under the same leadership? And why are there still gangs if there's no one to fight? And why does the most pre prestigious school 
in the nation that? invite the criminal overlord to well, be a student? Well, because obviously this government <laughs> is corrupt and like he's a piece in the cog of the greater government machine. You're trying to apply too much real world. <laughs> How? <It's> to Japan. <laughs> to, to Japan. <laughs> I don't know if you know this, but Japan is real. <laughs> no. Okay, he's oh. been there, so. The coronavirus took them. Yeah, yeah, we... Anyway, what? <laughs> what? Oh, man. Oh, no. Well, they have lots of cases in Japan, right? Like, yeah. of, the, of the coronavirus. Not many more than us now that oh. all those uh, <laughs> old people died in that home. True. From it. They're probably using coronavirus to cover up why they all really died. Anyway. <laughs> Government, man. It's, it's trying just... to call the whole population, man. Okay, stop. <laughs> you sound like a stoner. <laughs> on top of that... That's the whole point! On top of that, there's the ultimate martial artist, the ultimate fanfic create... Hey, me! The ultimate gambler, uh -oh. <laughs> the ultimate <laughs> swimming pro, the you're, ultimate programmer. You're, you're hey, it's you. No. The ultimate clairvoyant. Oh, you're that's make, me again. You're making me. And then some. <laughs> when, you, when you compare yourself to the ultimate fanfic writer, you're making me reconsider our relationship. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you even read my fanfic? No. You don't want to date How Hifumi? How dare you? <laughs> I write. The fact, the fact that I you create... wrote a fanfic is alarming to me. <laughs> <laughs> because I saw how bad all the other ones were, and I had to add my piece because it's so oh, much better. I told her about the um, the Internet Historian video about the uh, Harry Potter fanfic. We were supposed to watch that, <laughs> and I forgot. Nope, uh, I'm so glad we did. It's we beautiful. Have to watch it. It's amazing. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Reading that made me total realize how totally powerless I, I was. Was? Am. This is the same day. It was the country's finest top to bottom. 